My name is Guto Busat. I was born in Brazil, however, been living in South Africa for uh, 25 years now. I find that uh, this deals with a little bit of identity issues as uh, if you were born in Brazil, are you a Brazilian? Does it that make you a Brazilian? If I'm living here, does it make me a South African? These questions, I think, they come out through topics in my work. I think the similarities between South Africa and Brazil, uh, identity issues, etc. I specifically like conceptual art. However, I also like, which is, a, which is sometimes a one direct message. The biggest compliment is someone interpreting uh, the artwork in a new way, in an emotional way, and telling me, I think this is one of the biggest rewards of, of making art, apart from selling, <laughs> but uh, is to get people to, to feel moved by the artwork in some way and interpret it in another way and go through a journey. I have many careers. <laughs> One of them is the fine art career. But all of those careers, they overlap. So I have a career in film, which sometimes translates into a video installation. All the production knowledge that I have from our department, from visually, from composition, being a direct director, I'm a film director as well. Uh, that comes across, that complements my fine art. I think fine art is a career where I can express myself freely. I think fine art is a way where I can really tap into my subconscious and produce art that I think is not coming from me, it's coming from everybody. Interesting question. I wonder what sometimes these figures mean and who they are. In paintings, uh, I use several, let's call them dimensions to it. One of it is the texture, which in itself tells one story. The other elements are what is it painted over the texture. Sometimes this texture takes six months to produce where the, the, the figures that are paint and the other symbolism that comes across in the paintings are mainly in 2G form, which is, makes it very 2G, very simplistic. So there is a complexity in the textures and a simplicity in the figures. I didn't want to have both com complex figures with complex textures. I think they would kind of like not be balanced. As an artist, I see success in the form of, to me, success comes in the form of having people being interested in the work, having time, spend time discovering new dimensions, having time to go through a journey through my artwork. So I think the biggest reward, I would say, which is success, would be a great appreciation from the public. The art world is a very complex uh, place. Uh, I mean, I don't know how you're going to define what's the art world. Now, nowadays, everything is art. You know, like, what are the boundaries between fine art and pop art, music, and, you know. So I think the art world, perhaps the creative world, is full of creatives and full of people making money out of creatives and full of people spending money on creatives. So it is a, it, you know, it has to be, again, it has to be a balance. I would like to thank the Young Blood family for the opportunity to uh, be exhibiting here. Uh, it's a fantastic space with full of potential and, and many other uh, interesting things to see while you're here. So I feel very blessed, honored, and uh, I would like to thank everyone uh, who helped me with through this exhibition here. Hi, my name is Gutov Busab, and I'm the exhibit here at Yambla. Amazing. <laughs>